What's up, guys? You ready for some Pop King Paul and some Mystery Grill? Check it out. So how y'all doing? So I got some Pop King Paul from an auction. Some Pop King Paul stuff that I got. And some Mystery Grill that is supposed to be some um, autos. Like um, the 7 Bucks Pop Signature Series. So the only, you know, auto that I do have is this one. Which is Eric Vale. It says Decay. That's the only one I have. I think it's worth about... Like 175 something like that anyways so uh let's get into it uh let's do the pop king paul this is pop king paul right here and this was from an auction so i had to pick a box or it was like a winner's choice thing and whatever was there that's what i got i actually got two of them and i'll show you guys what i got Yeah, he usually does the auctions or whatnot, so that's what I'm doing. Um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, guys. Um, check out the other videos. You know, I would greatly appreciate that. And yeah. let's see. So, so the numbers that I picked were 26. And this was 26 right here. So it was the Jimi Hendrix... Funko exclusive. That's one of the ones I got. Okay. And the other one was 32. That was the number that I picked. It was 32. And 32 is right here. It's the Lucky Charms Leprechaun. Right? Show you guys the value of these. You know, on screen, you'll see it. Anyways, these were the two that I got. There were some other ones. Uh, I was okay with these, you know, I'd probably, they're not, you know, keep them in my collection. Lucky, a leprechaun with a decidedly ironic name. Bullied by children not much larger than he. His favorite and only treasure, taken time and time again. One, because I actually do have another one. I have the other Jimi Hendrix, you know, from the... Comic-Con. Yeah. 2021 Fall Convention one. Here's the yellow face. Anyways, so yeah, those are the two I got from Pop King Paul. Um, pretty good value for them, you know. So I still, you know, have something worth, worth something. Anyways, so yeah, that's the Pop King Paul and the mystery box. So this is a seven bucks a pop mystery box from Mystery Grill which means that all of them were signature series, which um, all of them were um, autos, which autographs. And there's a bunch of them in there and a couple, uh, a couple, sorry, a couple of top hits that I would want, like maybe John Cena, Johnny Depp. And there was some that I didn't want. And I'm talking to a friend and if I so happen to get that one that I didn't want, that's gonna be crazy. But anyways, so let's get into it. Uh, let me open this up. <clears throat> right. Sorry for not saying too much. Just trying to open it up real quick. Okay. All right. Seven bucks of pop signature series. Let's see, there it goes right there. Okay. All right. Uh, I don't know if it's supposed to feel heavy or not. It feels light, but I think that's okay. You know, they have candy in here, scratch cards where you can redeem stuff from their store or whatnot. So, let's see what we got. Three, two. One. Oh, ooh, I actually put the thing over it. All right, my bad. There we go. And if, you know, if we can hit a grill, which is the star on this, that'd be pretty cool. All right, three, two, one, go. Let's go. It's the Dennis Rodman one that I wanted. Let's freaking go. Dennis Rodman signed 
Funko Pop. I was talking about this one. I love basketball. This is, oh my God, 185 pieces. What? JSA authenticated. What? That's crazy. Oh man, this is, I, I guess this is not a grail, but this is a grail to me. Dennis Rodman, guys. Dennis Rodman. That is dope. Oh man, I have sports pops too. I have a bunch of them. You can probably see it. There you go, Magic Johnson. James Harden's back here. What? Damn, this is cool. This is so cool. Put that right there. Oh yeah, I got this. Anyone interested? <clears throat> Anyways. <clears throat> okay. Now for the second one. This one does feel a little bit heavier, but it's probably like a big pop or something like that. I'll put the value of that Dennis Rodman on there, you know, just in case you're wondering how much it actually cost or is worth. Sorry. Let's see. Got something over it. Oh, I didn't even do the scratch cards in there. I'm so focused. So excited. Right? Three, two, one. Not a star, but it's not the one that I said I didn't want. But to be honest, I, I, I don't really know. G.I. Joe's like that. Here goes G.I. Joe. Signed, JSA. Who is it signed by? Uh, not really sure, but 125 pieces. Oh, Morgan Lofting, the Baroness from G.I. Joe. All right, so here goes that. Looks like it's in great condition. Yeah. It's a 2021 pop. So there you go, guys. These two, these are the two that I got. Pretty happy with this one. This one, is, it is what it is. But uh, yeah, guys, like, comment, subscribe. Check out the videos. And hopefully you liked what I pulled. And, you know, leave me a comment. You know, tell me what you think. All right, guys. Peace. Oh, yeah. Got to do the scratchers. Let me do that real quick. Two hundred. Oh, don't worry. And two hundred. Just in case you wanted to know.